Book chapter B is been taking a look at a certain strand of life by Laura Wick. Here's our reading. Helen has been dead for 130 years. The Pseudo Rome to haul to the school that she has long gone upon taught when she in. And no one can see her, or so it appears in the appendix of the definition of a ghost. The strangest instance of feeling someone's eyes on her when she first met in shock, but now registered by fear by Helen. For all her transparency has not made her a star of any attention, and she has grown quite shy in it. Certain habits have become impossible to break, and for Helen, it is expected to put people to look right past her shadows. But the boy that stares at her is not ordinary human. Together, a certain kind of life takes readers on the odyssey of exploring eternal love, treasures, and the fear that keeps us in constant balance. Do you believe in what you see, or is the magic of everything we have no ground to trust in, only a side to the game of an illusion? While purchasing a certain kind of life, two things stood out from the design of the story. One, being the symbolic use of deeply disturbing words of an image to describe the action, and two, the promise of a novel akin to a romantic adventure, but also deeply disturbing and almost horror life. At first, that's what I pictured to my mind while acting as a The story itself is crafted with a smooth style and a fusion of multiple character viewpoints, and instead of horror, I felt intrigued and interested with the fascinated portion. For once, the fictional part of the story is not stretched out to the constant length of werewolves and vampires. Ghosts and spirits instead, when we is much more grounded to the superstition of afterlife most people have to thought about. It's also a journey of rediscovery in addition to anything else. The novel is certainly entertaining in the description of the dead and the love, the combination of sight and love, but it was a deeper moral that holds me into the short story. For one, it tells readers to take risks and challenge themselves to the things they should accomplish. Everyone has one life to live, and the afterlife, though it can be mysterious, is only procrastinating. Love wisely and act wisely. Then, can move. You will still taste life after the moment. Flick, haunting, and a great recollection of a, uh, a genre that we haven't seen for a very long time in young adult fiction. A certain fan of life will be your first story in the theory of an author. Chilling, although definitely not just pure horror as a real selling point, a certain fan of life should appease for years that want inspirational fantasy and romance in your papers. Our great for this novel is a solid name. We check out our floor on our website for a certain sign of life. That's it for Book Talk Cruise.